हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस हैबिटाट थैलस ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एंड सेल स्ट्रक्चर इन एक्टोकार्पस दिस एक्टोकार्पस इज ए ब्राउन एल्गा दैट कम्स अंडर फियोफाइसी दिस एक्टोकार्पस इज मेराइन so it has marine habitat that means it is found in oceans and it is found in every corner of the world so its distribution is cosmopolitan in india 16 species of ectocarpus is are found so in india 16 species of ectocarpus are found <laughs> now coming to thallus organization thallus of ectocarpus is multicellular and filamentous and in filamentous its thallus is heterotrichous type heterotrichous means hetero means different trichous is taken from word trichome trichome in filament means a thallus that has a different filament so this thallus have two type of filament <laughs> one filament that are here red in color they creep over the substratum or the surface so they are present parallel to the surface so here they are present parallel to the sub sur surface suppose this is substratum so they creeps over the substratum present parallelly on the substratum and they are attached to that substratum so these parallelly present filament are called prostrate filament and another filaments prostrate filaments that are present erect or upward these erect these that are present upward toward upward these filaments are called erect filaments these prostrate filament attaches to the surface and provide encroachment to the thallus and these erect filament they perform photosynthesis and reproduction <laughs> so this this filament is a large view of this filament here you can see that filament is, this filament is branched and multicellular and it have sporangia these green color sporangia are plurilocular sporangia and these red color sporangia are unilocular sporangia they are meant for reproduction we will discuss about them in detail in some another video so this is its thallus organization so thallus is heterotrichous means it have two type of filament prostrate filament and erect filament now coming to the cell structure cell of the filaments of ectocarpus is rectangular or cylindrical in shape and its cell wall have two different layer outer layer that is made up of alginin and fucoidin and inner layer this inner layer is made up of, made up of cellulose this is inner layer <laughs> and it have single nucleus that is present in the center and its chromatophores these green colored structures are chromatophore chromatophores are more than one these chromatophores are more than one number is more than one and these are ribbon like here you can see that these are ribbon like 
so more than one number is more than one these are ribbon like and they contain pyrenoid starch storing bodies in them these 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 bodies are pyrenoids these are pyrenoids and they also have fucoxanthin pigment that gives characteristic brown color to this thallus so this is habitat thallus organization and cell structure of ectocarpus so ectocarpus is marine and it is found in everywhere in every corner of the uh, you can say globe and its thallus is heterotrichous it have two type of thallus prostrate and erect thallus now coming to cell structure cell is rectangular or cylindrical in shape and it has two cell two layered cell wall outer is made up of alginin and fucoidin inner is made up of cellulose as nucleus is present in the center and it has chromatophores so the number is more than one they are ribbon shaped and they contains pyrenoids and beside pyrenoids they have fucoxanthin this green color pigment which gives brown characteristic brown color to the thallus